hello welcome back to my channel so here we are going to be discussing our area of rings area of rings area of shaded region or area of anodes okay yeah so example one consider this ring okay, this region is shaded 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 Okay. So the diameter here is 10 meter and for this place it is 7 meter. Okay. So let us calculate the area of the ring. We have the outer circle and we have the inner circle. So let's Radius of the outer circle is capital R, which is 7 meter. Radius of the inner circle is small r, which is 10 over 2, which is 5 meter. So the area of the ring equals to area of the outer circle minus area of the inner circle. The part is common. R square minus R square, which is 22 over 7 times um, 7 square minus minus 5 square okay so if we solve that equation we are going to obtain 22 over 7 into 4 9 minus 12 5 okay so this is 22 over 7 multiply by 24 over 1 okay so 24 into 20 plus 2 will give us of 480 plus 480 which is 8 2 plus this is 2 so that will give us 5 to 8 all over 7 so 7 and 52 7 7 and 49 and 38 5 7 times 5 is 35 we have 3 and 30 we have 4 and 20 we have 2 and in 60, I'm so not as you for so approximately the area is 75.4 centimeters square to one decimal places. So this is just how to calculate the area of the ring. Very simple and straightforward. So try the area of the inner circle from the area of the outer circle. And you have the area of the annulus. Okay. Now let's consider if you have a case of a sector. And you are looking for the area of the shaded portion. Okay. So consider this sector. So we have a sector of this form. Okay. Mm. And then you have another one with like this. So if this region is shaded, 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 and then if this if the length of this region is eight centimeter and the length of this region is six centimeter, so you have to find the area shaded. Find the area shaded. Find the area shaded to three significant figures. Okay. So let's take a look. Solution. We have um the bigger R radius bigger to be eight centimeter and the smaller R to be six centimeter. Remember that area of sector is theta over three sixty the good times by r square so now that we have a two of them so area of the shaded region is going to be theta over 360 times pi into capital r square minus r square that is the bigger region minus the smaller region okay so the angle 
of course the angle is 90 degree to times 90 degree yeah so if we substitute that we have 90 over 360 times um, 22 over 7 multiply by radius of the big circle is square minus radius of the small circle which is 6 squared okay so if we go right now here now here is 4 so we have 1 over 4 times the 22 over 7 multiply by 64 minus 36 okay now 2 in 4 will give us 2 2 in uh, 22 will give us 11 so here we have oh, 11 over 14 times 64 minus 36 should be able to give us okay for well, 14 minus 6 would give us um, 8 and the 5 minus 2 would give us 2 okay yeah who does go yeah 28 12 this is 4 this is 4 we have squared so we have 28 over 1 okay 14 here 1 14 here 2 so basically we have 11 times 2 which is 22 Centimeter square. Okay, so the area of the sector, the shaded portion, is 22 centimeter square. Very simple and straightforward. Let's take a look at one more example. Um, number three. Number three. Consider the sector. Sector. The sector and uh, we have uh, another one of this room and this place is shaded 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 okay so the angle of the sector is 60 degree the bigger radius over there is a um, 10 centimeter and this radius over here over to, uh, is a uh, 15 centimeter so calculate the shaded area okay so we we'll continue as well. Tip that the angle of sector is 60 degree. Radius of the bigger sector is 15 centimeter. For the smaller sector, we have it to be 10 centimeter. And the formula for calculating the shaded region is subtraction theta over 360 times pi r square uh, pi into r square minus r square okay so we can substitute into this formula to find our area so we have a equals to 60 degree we have 360 degree times 22 over 7 into r big r 15 square minus 10 square so this will give us here we're going to say over there 6 here we have 6 so we have 1 over 6 times 22 over 7 into 225 minus 100 okay so it's very interesting so this will give us 1 over 6 times 22 over 7 times uh, 1 to 5 okay so 2 here 3 we have 2 here it's going to give us 11 okay 3 here 1 3 here uh, uh, 3 can go in that yeah it's can go so we have uh, 125 times 11 okay it will give us 125 times 11 which is uh, 